Now to a big breaking story here at home. The cousin of Zion Foster has now been charged with her murder. 17 year old Zion went missing back in January of 2022. Her cousin uh, Jalen Brazier had been the main person of interest in the case while now charged with first degree murder. Sean Lay following this story really since she went missing and Sean her body has still not been found. That's the key. Her body, Zion Foster, her body has never been found here. So now we have a murder charge. And Devin and Christy, you set this up perfectly. This is a big deal. It's a big deal for Zion Foster's mother. We have stayed close to her month after month. Of course, this is essentially, she says, ruined her life, not having her daughter. But now the prosecutor's office, Wayne County Prosecutor's Office, believes there's enough evidence now to bring a murder charge. This is news Zion Foster's mother, Sierra, tells me she has been praying for but thought would never come. Zion Foster's cousin, Jalen Brazier, has been charged by the Wayne County prosecutor with first degree murder. He made his first court appearance late this afternoon. Foster went missing after January 5th of 2022. She was last with her cousin, Jalen Brazier. She went missing. Her body has never been found. Brazier said Zion just suddenly died as the two were smoking marijuana. He says he panicked and put her body in a dumpster without telling anyone. That eventually led to Detroit police searching a landfill last summer, but nothing was found. The investigation never stopped, and now Prosecutor Kim Worthy says enough evidence has been presented to her office to accuse Brazier of the murder of Zion Foster. Back here live, immediately reached out to Zion's mother. She has moved out of state. We hope to hear from her and her reaction uh, as this proceeds. What is that evidence that without a body, without Zion Foster's remains ever been found? That's not clear yet, guys. Uh, that we know a search warrant was served uh, at the home where Brazier was living, but this is going to go to a preliminary hearing, and that's where we hope to hear that key evidence that homicide detectives were able to gather to get this uh, warrant signed by the prosecutor. In the meantime, it was quite a battle in court, guys, over bond. With the, at the very end, the magistrate is holding Brazier without bond tonight. Charges, Sean, but still so much mystery remains. All right, Sean.